Activities of the Nigerian troops in various theater operations across the country have continued to record tremendous success in the offensive against sundry crimes bedeviling the nation. This is as troops of Operation Safe Heaven forestall activities of vandals as well as economic saboteurs in the Niger Delta region. With 39 illegal refining sites, 17 large dugout pits, and 96 storage tanks discovered and immobilized. Addressing a news conference in Abuja to update Nigerians on its strides from the 6th to 20th January 2022, the Coordinator of Defense Media Operations, Major General Bernard Onyoko, noted that about 950,000 liters of stolen crude oil was recovered in the course of the operation with 10 suspects arrested. Troops discovered and immobilized a total of 39 illegal refining sites, 91 cooking ovens, 24 reservoirs, 17 large dugout pits and 96 storage tanks. Also, a total of 637,500 liters of illegally refined automotive gas oil. 950,000 liters of stolen crude oil were recovered in the course of the operations. Troops of Operation Hadinkai also in the period under review neutralized 37 terrorist elements with 17 others arrested and large cache of arms and ammunition recovered. A total of 863 terrorists and their families comprising 136 adult males, 251 adult females, and 476 children surrendered to own troops at different locations, including Banki, Bama, Dikwa, Goza, Gamboru towns in Borno State within the period. The surrendered terrorists and their families have been profiled and handed over to appropriate authorities for necessary action. The briefing further highlighted the onslaught against banditry, armed robbery, drug peddlers, among others, in the northwest and north central by troops of Operation Hadarin Daji, Safe Heaven, and Wales Truck, with a defense spokesman revealing significant results. These operations resulted in the neutralization of 12 armed bandits. Arrest of 15 others, including their collaborators, 16 assorted weapons, and 136 rounds of different calibers of ammunition, and 114 livestock were recovered by own troops within the period. Five criminals were arrested, while nine different types of arms, including AK-47 rifles and locally made guns, as well as 742 rounds of different calibers of ammunition were recovered. Additionally, troops rescued two kidnapped civilians and recovered two motorcycles, while large quantities of cannabis sativa were impounded in the course of the operations within the same period. Assuring of effort to sustain the temple, the military high command reinstated the commitment of the military and other security agencies to remain decisive in tackling the prevailing security challenges until peace and normalcy is restored in the country. CNN News.